People, welcome back to another edition of the Coach's Desk with host Coach Minzi. Yeah, man, and we have some news as usual <laughs> that we want to share with you. And this time we will be on the matter of athletics. Yeah, people. And um, some, 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 some sad news and some good news. You understand? Uh, let me start with the good news because people... Kemba Nelson is at it again. She opened her season outdoor people. And can I tell you that season opener outdoor was actually a PR, a personal record or a personal best, as some would say, or a lifetime best. So people, this youngster is doing extremely well. And I, for one, I'm very proud of her. I'm, I'm, I'm liking the, pro, the, the progress that has been made. And I tell you, she looks extremely good. She looks extremely dangerous going into the national trials. So, I'm sounding the warning Fan favorites out there in Jamaica for the national trials. Just, just, just be careful. Yeah, man, we know you have the experience. But I'm saying just be careful because if you slip, you're going to slide. And Kemba Nelson, I tell you, will take your spot. Now, Nelson clocked a time, people, of 11.18 seconds. At a meet West Coast Classic in Tucson. Very, very good run. She also ran the uh, 200 meters, but she was beaten. But she also got another um, lifetime best in the 200 meter. 23.03 seconds. Very good running from uh, Kemba Nelson. And I'm telling you, I'm saying it again. Fan favorites, just be careful. Don't take these athletes who are coming for, from U.S. lightly when it's time for the national uh, trials. They are going to want to prove that's what they want to do. So, trust me, th this, this young girl is doing pretty well. And this is off the heels of a, a, a very good indoor season where she won national uh, title over there in, in, in America. Yes, she's doing extremely well. And I kid you not, I kid you not. Just remember that I told you. Yeah, man, just remember. This kid ran 7.05 seconds. Yeah, man, in the 60-meter NCAA Indoor Championship. Guess what? She's the fifth fastest Jamaican woman indoors, people. Um, persons who are in front of her would have been uh, uh, one Merlin Joyce Otty, Shelley and Fraser Price and others. But trust me, this kid, she's fast. This kid is improving rapidly. This kid is having a stellar season. Don't take her for granted understand people so i know the guru is ready to to unleash his charges broad bell was unleashed uh, over the past weekend as well so elaine thompson will be will be gone in as well so i mean trust me i i'm not taking anything away from them but i'm just giving them a little advice, a little encouragement. Just be careful. Watch out for these collegiate athletes coming in. All right, so let's switch lanes to the 400 meters. And um, trust me, uh, this athlete, Akeem Bloomfield, would have been uh, training in the U.S., trained with MVP International, and um, he, he, he was... In an, uh, uh, an event uh, some time ago, 
and he got hurt. Um, from what I have learned is that it is not a very serious injury. You understand? And he's recovering nicely. But something um, sad would have happened in Akim's life. And someone who gave him life, his mother, is in need of help, people. Financial help. And I'm pleading with the track and field fraternity who loves Akeem Bloomfield, who loves to see him run. Um, his mother is suffering from stage 4 breast cancer, according to reports. He actually posted it on his Instagram page. And that tells me he, he is in need of the assistance. He, he put it out in the public. Um, it wasn't um, said to him by his mom. He didn't want, um, according to what the reports are saying, is that she didn't want to distract them. You know what I mean? And you know, Casey, old boys always come together and do what they do. You now, one of your alumni is actually in need of help. And I am not worried. Because KC Massive will do what it takes to assist Elizabeth Palmer in this uh, grave situation. Yeah, man, she, she, she has stage 4 breast cancer. It has spread to the bones, according to um, Akeem. And um, it would have caused her to, you know, had, have some problems in her, in her hip. I understand uh, where that is concerned and um, he is seeking help from the public because she needs to do a, a surgery um, because from waist down she's actually paralyzed people yeah man and she need to fix her spine with a surgery before she can actually start the chemotherapy so this is urgent 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 people urgent the medical bill is very high when it comes on to um you know a, a a a thing called cancer sickness is a is a thing that respects no one it doesn't matter who you are rich poor and the likes so if you can assist the jamaican sprinter who many of you would have watched at champs, running fast. He went to the world championship in 2019. You understand? He was actually a finalist. And many of you were rooting for him. At this time, he needs your assistance. See what you can do. Might I tell you, or hasten to tell you, that you can go over to his Instagram page to give him uh, the support that he needs. In his uh, description, you're going to see the Go fund me link. Just, just share it. Um, he specifically say you can share it, you can donate to it, or you can pray for his family right now because they are in, uh, in need of your prayers, in need of your support, whether it be uh, cash kind or tangibles or non-tangibles. So people, your man, prayers up for, for Akeem Bloomfield's mother, Elizabeth Palmer. Yeah, man, we want to send this out there so that persons can give assistance where that is concerned. So go over to Akeem Bloomfield's Instagram page, people. Check it out and see how best you can support the youngster. You understand? He is in need. And to be specific, his mother is in need um, of of. of, of funds financial help they need right now yeah i know some persons who aren't able to do financial help but they they they, they need the help financially financially people yeah man for those who don't know is 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 instagram handle it is zoom dot underscore dot 43 yeah man go check it out and um 
the first picture you'll see it is going to be the picture of his mom and himself embracing each other so support the thing people support the thing support the youngster yeah man it, it, it's a situation where her life can be saved if if whatever is to be done is done in quick time so i'm certain that it is going to go out S share the link his gofundme link is also on his instagram you don't have to also go in the description it is right there on his, his page so people we're, we're 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 seeking your help and i'm pleading to pleading to you right now to assist the youngster assist a life yeah man in any way you can thanks again for tuning into the coaches desk people big up yourselves see you next time in another video out